Russia's Ilya Kulik is the most artistic skater in the field. And he puts it all together. He really is extraordinary. If there's one flaw, it's that he's just not as consistent as Alba Stoika. However, this is an outstanding short program. Think back to the Skate International of Canada. He was skating beautifully. Then he got to the double axle at the end and only did a single. He's got to hit all the required elements. Triple axle, triple toe loop. Ah. Very good. Triple jump with footwork leading into it. The triple Lutz, difficult entry. No problem. A death trap. Peter, he looks as though he's skating a little bit conservatively, but he knows that he all he has to do is land all the elements. It doesn't have to be absolute perfection. That's what the short program's about, but look at this footwork section. This is incredible. He tells us the costume represents a man and his personal struggle, a tangled net which he tries to break free. This is what he missed at Skate Canada, the double axle, no problem there. Concentration intact. Circular footwork, very interesting changes of position, changes of direction, changes of tempo in the steps, the gliding. That's what it's all about, variety. Dorothy, you said it absolutely right. Conservative, but the name of the game in the short program is hitting the eight required elements, and he did just that. That's the performance to beat tonight. Are the others up to the task? Up next, Todd Eldridge takes his shots. Does he have enough ammunition? We know.